living here hasn't exactly been perfect for any of us. Firstly, there was the business with Alicia. Great. Like I need reminded. Well, maybe not, but people don't forget. And then the helicopter crash. Look, we all have things that we want to put behind us. Yeah, and I have. So why should any of us have to run away? It's not about running away. It's about making a fresh start as a family. I mean, that's what this place was supposed to be about. But all it's brought us is heartache. I don't know about you, but I'm, I'm tired of fighting. What about the business? Well, it's hardly booming, is it? Any more than your salons. But all that matters to me now is right here, in this room. I cannot tell you how amazing it would be. You always said how jealous you were of me traveling. Now's your chance. You're not actually considering this, are you? Well, I don't know. Just, I think Dad could be right. This place has brought nothing but bad memories. What about Belle? Look, you're still young. There's a whole world out there to be explored. Do you realize how exciting that could be? Look, I know this is a lot to take in. Look, let's just at least think about it. This could be the best thing for this family. The sooner the better for me before Robert has a chance to stop me. What do you mean? That he could apply for a court order to stop me from taking Seb out of the country. Only if he found out. And I don't intend to give him the chance to. So, if you are thinking about coming with me, you need to make your minds up fast. Jimmy, I'm meeting my solicitor in the office. So if you could uh, make yourself scarce this afternoon. It's not about the haulage, is it? No, I'm, I'm, I'm working on getting my son back. Oh, well, can't argue with that. Thanks, mate. Sorry, uh, haulage business. Oh, no, never apologise where money's concerned. <laughs> I can see you, your father's son, all right. Never switch off from a deal, eh? And a real man of the people. I've always said he should go into local politics. He's got the common touch. This might seem a bit left field, but I'd like to introduce you to some of my contacts. What sort of contacts? Ones who could really use a bloke like you on their team. For the right price, of course. Can I tempt you to a cream bun? Are you being good after Christmas? Are you soon have put on weight? What? No. <laughs> no, of course not. You're perfect just the way you are. I like a woman with a bit of substance about her. What's that supposed to mean? There you go. I'd say you need to brush up on those chat-up lines as you're punching up a belt or two. Uh, coffee? What's up? No smart remark, that's not like you. No. I only deal with your family through my solicitor now. We'll save any misunderstandings, like yesterday. Well, you can try, I suppose, but it's not going to work. We're already one step ahead of you. You're never going to get your hands on, sir. Yeah? That's what you think. What's all that about? I oh, just him, thinking he can get his own way as usual. I'm sick of it. You know, sometimes I wish it could just be me and you. Lucky it's me. Listen, I know, I know you're with Belle, but I've been thinking about Australia. I just want you to know that you don't have to do anything that you don't want to do and we'll work something out. Listen, we'll talk about it when you come back. I love you. Dad? Hello? Hello?